He's inside the school shooting at the kids. That was a call to 911 at 11.33 a.m. May 24th. A gunman was inside Robb Elementary School in Uvalde shooting at children. Witnesses knew it, and at least some of the emergency responders knew it too. That's based on recordings of more than 20 calls and dozens of hours of radio traffic between dispatchers and officers obtained by the Texas Tribune and ProPublica. Uvalde County, 911. Hello, ma'am. Can you hear me? This child's muffled call came into 911 from inside a classroom where kids had been shot. It was 12.03. The shooter had been inside more than 30 minutes. Officers had swarmed the campus. More than a dozen were in a hallway steps away. But they waited to storm in. This is school shooting. Yes, I, I'm aware. I was talking to you earlier. You're still there in your room? You're still in room 112? Yeah. Okay, you stay on the line with me. Do not disconnect. That's just one of 10-year-old Chloe Torres's calls. Can you tell the police to come to my room? I already told them to go to the room. We're trying to get someone to you. By now, it was 1236. Police had been there more than an hour. Chloe told the dispatcher she thought she heard them. You hear anyone come in, but they're not supposed to be. They don't say that they're police. Y'all pretend that you are asleep, okay? At 1250, police went in and killed the shooter. Chloe Torres, who you heard there, was injured, but she did survive. And to reiterate, her family gave the okay for the Texas Tribune to publish those calls. Radio traffic and body camera footage does reinforce some officers on scene were aware of Chloe's 911 calls from a room full of kids and teachers in need.